Hi, this is Christina from OfficeToDo.com. In this lesson, we are going to talk about how to take back your mistakes in Office Word. What I mean is that when you have done something to a document that you didn't actually want. In most cases, you don't have to worry about it because Office comes with an undo command, which means that you can take back your recent action. So when you have, for an example, deleted an important part of your text, you can just press undo and everything will be restored. Let's see how it works. Here we have some text and I will delete part of it. Remember, it's not only for deleting, but almost any action you do in Word can be taken back. Now I want to undo my action. By default, Office has added undo button to quick access toolbar. There is a blue arrow in it. When you press it, you will be taken back one action. Next to the blue arrow, there is a small arrow down. When you click on it, you'll see all your latest actions and how far you can go back. If you want to take back many actions, it's more effective to just choose where you want to be in the end. You may have noticed that there is a redo button next to the undo button. This will only be available when you have used undo before. For an example, you undo too much and you want to restore the original action. So here I have undone my delete action I have decided that I still want to delete that text. So instead of deleting it again, I just press redo and it will be removed. One side note here as well. If you haven't done undo, then redo button is replaced with repeat button. You can use this to repeat the same text you just typed over and over if you ever need it. Usually it's wise to use keyboard shortcuts for undo, for which you should hold CTRL and press Z. Redo and repeat shortcut is CTRL and Y. It's not as comfortable to use as undo because, because it's not used as often. So it's wise to just remember undo shortcut which is CTRL and Z. Thanks for watching and see you in the next lesson at office2do.com. Bye!